I was left alone. My, my parents left me alone just to draw. And I drew, you know, console one time I was to hold a pencil. His stuff's not silly like a lot of uh, science fiction illustrations. This stuff is well thought out uh, based on what he knows and continues to learn. And you get the feeling it's realistic. I mean, it's not just a hodgepodge, but it, it could be, it's real. just to do the cars, but it became a natural progression, you know, that within his designs there were sort of conceptual ideas in the background, in the foreground of his drawings, and it was a natural that he would be the designer of the street signs, the, the flashing uh, walk signs, uh, every, everything that was a significant visual aspect of the movie was, was thrown into Sid Mead's hands. creates something and he draws it on paper, uh, he visualizes that that really can happen, that it, it's a shape that, that is possible, it's a shape that can be done and, and, and will be done. And of course, you know, some of his stuff that, that uh, he did way back in the 50s in the U.S. Steel catalogs are just now happening. The expression that I use quite often uh, that I would say applies perfectly to Sid Mead's illustration and design is that it reminds you of something you've never seen before. 